if you're here, you probably are interested in converting uh, a bunch of sheets of paper, so something like this, all right, that you have. Uh, maybe it's a form that you need uh, to maybe to send to your bank. Uh, you want to send it to a friend, um, an accountant, or something like that, and you have numerous pages, you don't have a scanner, and you're kind of stuck. Um, or maybe it's uh, sheets for school, assignment, test, whatever it may be. If we're living in the digital world, we do communicate, so it's definitely worthwhile knowing how to create uh, just a single file out of pages that maybe you have written on or you signed. So that's what I'm gonna show you in this video. There's going to be two methods. Uh, one is going to be on the assumption that you may have either an iPhone or an iPad. So it's kind of Apple uh, biased. Um, but if you do not have and you're using other products, I will show you another method which you can use with anything. Okay. Um, so the first one utilizes Notes, okay, which is a free app within um, an iPhone or an iPad. And then the second method uses smallpdf.com, which is a website that Oh boy, I have used for quite a long time uh, um, because to this day they still allow you two scans for free per day. So that will serve the purpose. And that's going to be uh, towards the end of the video and you'll see a little note, okay, if you want to use that other method. If you don't have uh, an Apple product, you can just fast forward to that and I'll put a timestamp so that you can know where to fast forward to. Um, I've done this video before, uh, but unfortunately, one of the apps that I used to use, um, it seems like it's not free anymore. I guess it has become popular. Last video, I mean, I can put a link up above, um, but uh, this video will serve the purpose. All right, so let's get to it. So if you are working with notes, okay, so for example, so this is a screen of my um, iPad that I'm going to do this on. Okay, so notice the notes is there. So just that's the only app that you need. Okay, so I'm going to hit the notes. Okay, and now on the top uh, corner, okay, you see a little photo. Okay, so a little camera there. So if you click on the camera, okay, and then it says scan documents. So that's what we want to be able to take a look at. All right, so let me clear my desk a little bit and then I'll show you kind of how I set this thing up. Um, so I'm going to hit scan document. Okay, so I'm going to kind of put lift this up a little bit in here. And when, if you're scanning, make sure, you know, so I, for instance, you know, I have, I like to put it okay, and I'll get up too as well, just so that I can do this. Okay, so we can have that. I'm going to lift the camera up a little bit. Okay. So now this one, it just took one. So no, I'm going to say retake. Okay, so notice that I put kind of um, a boundary or I put the paper, okay, on uh, a place where the scanner can easily pick it up. And notice that it is picking it up rather well. So I'm going to just hit, there we have it. You know, so it says drag near the, um, the content there. Okay, so I mean, it's, it has perfect. So if you wanted to adjust it, you could have adjusted if it was a little bit off. So it's beautiful. So keep the scan. All right, so that's the uh, first one, okay? So now, typically you may have multiple pages. I made some funny pages in here. So here's the second one. All right, so I'm gonna hit that. All right, adjust it. No, it's pretty good. So keep that one. All right, so now that's two already. And then here is my final one. Um, yeah, so hopefully the video would be useful. So there you have it. Okay, let me hit that. All right, and again, so you can adjust it if necessary. All right, and then you keep the scan. All right, and now we have it. Okay, and now, so I'm just gonna hit save. So now that you've hit save, okay, so here is your scan document, okay, that you see on the screen there. And once you have that scanned document, okay, so you can now upload it Okay, if you wanted to, okay? So you can go to this document, all right? So this one right there, okay? You can still add it, adjust it, okay? Do whatever it is, um, or in the top right-hand corner, okay? So that you see there, you know, you can upload it. And now you can upload it to anything that you like. Um, you can airdrop it to something else, you know, you, I mean, I have Gmail, you know, I have my drive, Okay, you can use it and upload it to whatever it is that you want. 
um, so you can save it there you can once you have that um, you can even save to files so save to files within here all right and then you can put them into the files that you want maybe in your iCloud or something like that so that's the first method right that we would have let me um, get out of here so I'm gonna go in here so let me switch okay the second method that I mentioned was um, small okay pdf.com all right okay so that's small pdf.com which I've used for a while this is just a regular website so if for whatever reason your notes doesn't work you don't have an Apple product um, or you just want to give this a go okay so here you will notice that you have quite a selection right so it says you know seven day free trial of small PDF if you wanted to um, I have no affiliation to this so I'm not making any money or anything like that I just uh, have used uh, these converters you know to merge files and all kinds of different wonderful things and they do allow you a um, couple of those per day. So if we're gonna do the exactly same thing, we're gonna hit, hit JPEG okay, to PDF. Now JPEG just means it's an image because we're gonna be taking images. Um, and here, so notice it says choose files. If you've taken pictures of your form or your document, you can choose those files you know, if you wanted to okay, from various different sources. Okay, so you can do that. Now, I'm gonna assume that if you're doing this, maybe you haven't taken pictures yet, so I'm gonna say, so from device, and notice, take photo, okay? And now I can take an actual photo, and I'm gonna do kind of exactly the same thing. So for instance, okay, so notice, so here would have been my page one, okay? And now I can take my photo, okay, within here. Now this, it won't be as nice because of the fact that, um, you know, and you can kind of see I, I have a glare there because of the shadow, okay, because as I'm connected, okay, so I can take a photo of this, okay, so that's my first photo, okay, so use photo, um, and no, notice that it adds that up, okay, so we can add it to files, all right, so that's the first one, okay, then you can say, all right, so I want to take another photo, so let's say if we had another page, so I could have taken, let's say, page number two here, and here it is, all right, so here's my second page. Just make sure that you do it so that whoever is receiving it can actually see what you're doing and notice that it has, okay, now two of those uh, pages and you can continue those pages as you're going through, all right? So sorry, I stood up there so you didn't exactly see me, okay? So this is what, um, what we have. Now I can hit convert, all right? So if you had more pages, you could have done it. And notice it says, you know, free tasks. There's, you know, this was your first free one. So now it's gonna be converting the file um, for you. Okay, and so let, let it convert there so that you can um, see it, all right, on the screen. Okay, and let me, so there we have it. So that's our, uh, that's our file there. Okay, let me move this so that you can see it. It's a little bit bigger. All right, and now, um, you know, you can continue there in terms of download, right? So you can download it, save to device, um, whatever it is that you wanna do that with that particular file, you can do it. You can also rename it, right? Once you save it to whatever it is that you have, okay? And then there you have it. So now you know how to create one PDF file. Um, hopefully one of these two methods will work for you. All right. Okay. So thanks for watching. Um, and you know, you can hit a like and maybe subscribe if you found this useful. Okay. Bye everybody. Cheers.